In the beginning of the last century, the Wright brothers and dozens of other innovators called Dayton their home. At that time, Dayton had more patents per capita than any other city in the world. It is that innovative spirit that made Dayton what it is today. I'm Raj Soin, founder of Soin LLC, and I believe that the innovative spirit still remains the pillar of our business community. Our local universities, major research laboratories, and the business leaders are continuously pushing the boundaries with ideas that can change the world markets. As an entrepreneur, I trust these innovations are vital for our growth, and I feel privileged to work with the Dayton Area Chamber of Commerce in recognizing these innovators. This year, we proudly recognize Lunny as the recipient of the Soin Award for Innovation. I created Lunny out of my own experience as a breastfeeding mom. At the time, it was January 2021. It was still pretty hard in the pandemic and being isolated. I was a stay-at-home mom. And I was just feeling really isolated and kind of thinking more about this postpartum experience and how hard it was. And I started getting really fixated on my nursing bra. I was wearing these horrible disposable pads in my bra and I just thought, why isn't there kind of a chic, comfortable nursing bra that actually has a leak-proof layer built in? And when I couldn't find it, that's kind of what led me down the road to create it. The first thing I thought about was data. Am I the only person with this problem or are there more moms out there? So I created a Google survey, I sent it out to other moms that I knew and 84% of moms said they were dissatisfied with their nursing bra. So that was truly my light bulb moment. The first prototype I created with my mom, I call it my Frankenstein bra because it was really just kind of a mashup of different materials and components of bras that I liked. And then we found a leak proof fabric that we just sewed into the bra to test as a concept. I had the amazing opportunity to partner with the University of Dayton through their Stitt Scholar program and lab tested it for weeks to see how it performed in comparison. And the amazing thing is, is that Lenny came up number one every single time. Lenny is up to six times more absorbent than any other product on the market. I took this prototype in a little pink bag and would contact moms, drop it off at their doorstep, have them try it on, give me feedback, and then use that to create and make it better. Specifically, it was the women here in Dayton in my own backyard that helped me with testing those prototypes. This community grew from this survey to this in-person group here in Dayton and then eventually expanded to broader social media channels. And now I call it my, my community, Lenny Hive. Um, it's over many thousands of women um, are part of it and continue to help me with product development and creating the brand that it is today. Over the course of the year, we went through six prototypes. And after six prototypes, we nailed the final design. By the time I actually launched in March 2022, I sold out of my first production run with zero marketing dollars. And again, that's thanks to this true passion and community of moms that are behind it. About nine months into this journey, I found out I was pregnant with my third daughter. What's been really cool is I'm, I'm living and breathing this experience. I wear my Lenny bra every day. I have a nine month old daughter that I nurse. So it's, it's really cool to be able to still relate to moms in that authentic way because this is my life too. I launched my first retail location um, at Shop Smitten in Oakwood, which was so special to me because it's a place that I love to shop. I was so excited when I found out that I won the Soin Award for Innovation. I had presented on a Friday morning and then got a call Friday afternoon that I had won. I had the phone on speakerphone. I was with two of my daughters that so they could hear and they were kind of going woo in the background, which was so fun to share it with them. Having this $25,000 grant helps me be able to invest in this larger inventory and scale in a meaningful way and take kind of that stress out of where is this next funding going to come from. It's also about just having this stamp of validation, of credibility, and having other people recognize that postpartum moms really matter. This brand, this product,
product, it's really critical. This leak-proof nursing bra is truly just an entry product in what I envision Lenny to be this entire brand line of postpartum intimates for moms. There's so many needs. I'm already working on developing new products. Receiving this sewing award for innovation makes me so excited for the future. With this money, with the award, with the validation, I think really will help accelerate my growth. And I'm so grateful. I'm just so honored to have this sewing innovation award behind money and the Dayton Chamber of Commerce. It really, it means the world.